Hey everyone and welcome on back to Be Care Reviews where today I actually have a review of the Leviathan Axe from God of War. This is a Ruby's foam replica. I'm going to show you all the little details and carvings but just remember that with this review you can't really do much with this other than just swing it around and pretend like you're Kratos. So if you like what you see that's really going to be the determining factor. And here we go guys, this is the foam replica of the Leviathan Axe which is Kratos' main weapon in God of War 2018. Now this was made by, I believe it was Ruby's, like the costume and prop company. However, I picked this up at my local party city. There will be a link in the description to the exact like page that I bought it from. But it is just beautiful, especially for 25 bucks. You are getting a very high quality foam replica. This replica is 36 inches long. And while it may not seem like much, once you actually get a tape measure, and just uh, measure that out, you can see just how big this will be. And while it's by no means heavy, it does have a pretty good dense and just quality feel to it. And for 25 bucks in the US, this is definitely worth it. Again, I'll just go over the small details because there's not much to say about it, just more for you guys to see. That's where you would put those runic attacks. Really good wood sculpting. You have some nice designs in there, just like in the game. The wraps are the same color, which is my only real like gripe with this, is that these aren't a lighter color, but it really doesn't matter because these look still just so detailed. And then right here you can see the Dwarf Brothers uh, branding. There's the end of it. And here's just the really detailed side. It is absolutely beautiful. One more thing that I do want to mention is that this is pretty sturdy. Even though it's just foam, mine has just a tiny bit of a bend, but yeah, this is durable. And the only real problems I've had is, I'll try and get that for you, right there, some of the paint application is flaking away, but you could barely even notice it, and that's only if you do uh, hit it against something or something like that. And there you have it guys. As I said, this is a really good piece, very high quality, especially for that $25. This is incredibly well done. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it and feel like I deserve it, please do leave a like and maybe comment as that always, always helps. If you want to see some more reviews, cosplay stuff, or Lego stuff, please check out the channel. I think you'll like what you see. But with all that being said, I will see you guys in the next one.